The surprise attacks carried out after the declaration of war saw the peacekeeping forces of various countries, including Osea, suffer major damage. The ships moored around the space elevator and near Gandar Bay have been hit particularly hard. Numerous ships have been sunk and abandoned. Fortunately, our cutting-edge aircraft carrier, Kestrel-2, was at sea, so it was spared from the attack. Kestrel-2 is now preparing to launch another attack against Arugia's capital, Barbanti. The aircraft carrier Vulture also managed to escape Gandar Bay safely. However, it lost all its aircraft, so it's sailing empty. Today, the International Union Peacekeeping Force reclaims its bid to the space elevator. The Fort Gray's Island Air Base Squadron will rendezvous with the carrier Vulture for a joint mission. The first objective will be to seize air superiority in Choppenburg in order to secure a route for the support squadrons. The enemy maintains air superiority over Choppenburg, so expect heavy resistance from enemy aircraft. There's more, so listen carefully. Right from the start of the war, the enemy has been deploying drones. They're using a new, advanced type of drone. The unmanned airborne aircraft carrier, the Arsenal Bird, carries this new drone, MQ-101. The Ocean Army headed up the development of the massive Arsenal Birds and dispatched them to the space elevator to provide support. However, it's been reported that the carriers may have fallen into the hands of the Erujian forces. If that's true, it could be a significant obstacle for us. We need to regain control of the space elevator ASAP. Good luck out there. Squadron aircraft preparations complete. Squadron, this is the situation. Gollum and the other base's squadrons already joined forces and are engaged. You guys will arrive right in the middle of the action. Mage Squadron, eliminate all bandits in the current airspace. We have the upper hand, but that doesn't mean we can ease up. Good luck. Mage 1, Wilco.
Breach two. Box two. Breaking out of lock. Watch out. The enemy has a lock on Shows no sign of bandits. You're in the clear. But I haven't even broken a sweat. They have to be crazy to pick a fight with us. A rabid dog would know better. Missile incoming! Break, break, Invade! Break! Break! Wait, what the hell? Caution! Missile! Caution! Large aircraft is approaching. All aircraft, stay alert. Squadrons command is ordered to complete withdrawal. 
the operation area immediately. Brilliant observation. They knew it earlier, or it would have survived in Green. Save your chatter for the debrief. Gollum and Mage Squadron, give our allies some time to escape. Muko, but Gollum 2 is hit. Gotta send her back. Let's get dirty, Trigger. Shoot down those UAVs. Don't let them touch any friendlies. Gollum 2, head back to base. Gargoyle 1, escort Gollum 2. Continuing the mission. Still got my wings. Trigger doesn't need to fill in for me. I'm back and I... You won't make any difference up here. Get back to base and cool your head. Copy that. Returning home. Damn it! I can't break away! I'm glued to this one. Don't think. Focus. Retreating aircraft. Leave the AO. Allies will hold off pursuit. Golem Squadron, Mage Squadron, hang in there and come back safe. Mage Squadron, you're going toe-to-toe -to -toe with the UAVs. Good work. Spotted. Gargoyle Squadron, they might cut off your retreat. My status is fine. Affirmative. This is Gargoyle 1. Leading Operation Airspace with Column 2. Retreating aircrafts, prepare for combat. It's a bogey. Gargoyle 1, Column 2, engage now. Attack. One bad. Missing three. Gargoyle 1, caution! Missile! Skykeeper, Gargoyle 1 lost. What the hell? Column 2, status report. <sighs> Just talk to me. I'm against an SU-30. Orange wingtips. I can't shake it off. It's matching me move for move. Column 2, stop dogfighting and run. <sighs> Mage 2, move to support. Other aircraft are in. 
of trouble. Behind one. Pass the guidance limit. Make a visual landing. Nicely done, Mage 2. I knew you'd be back. Stand by for further orders. Be ready for your next sortie. Mage Squadron, this is... Unfortunately, the two-front offensive was a failure. The aircraft carrier Kestrel-2 was sunk during the attack on Farbanti. Carrier-borne aircraft mistakenly bombed urban areas, and this has turned public opinion in neutral countries against us. Our own forces also suffered heavy losses. If it weren't for a few extraordinary fighters, many of us wouldn't have made it home. The situation is grim. We have precious little time, however. We have to get to the space elevator.